it's been about 18 or 19 years ago now. Muckle Teal School District, not directly connected with you guys, I know. Muckle Teal School District had a, had a dispute going on between parents and teachers about the teaching of a book in the schools. How familiar is that? And what, the, what one group of parents decided they didn't want taught in the schools was Ray Bradbury's Martian Chronicles. And they thought they had prepared a political assailant on this that was insurmountable. He uses the word hell in this book. We don't want our kids using the word hell. He also uses the N-word, which, as we all know, watching HBO or Django and Chains is pretty much everywhere now. He uses, but he, he's, 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 he's profane and he's racist, and this book is a profane, racist book. And that was so completely off my experience of having read the book. The teachers prepared for this. I went in and advised a little bit uh, and, and attended the meeting where they hashed this out with the school board, and it was dicey. The school board came down five to four in favor of keeping the book. But the whole uh, 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 publicity drive from the schools, the teachers, the newspapers was so powerful that the woman, the poor woman who started this whole campaign and straw bossed it, got up and apologized afterwards. She says, I didn't realize how passionate people were about this. And she learned a real lesson, which was there is a committed um, approach among teachers and even among most parents to the future and among school board members. There's a commitment to realize that, no, we cannot shut down because of controversy what our kids are seeing or reading. 